Hello everyone and welcome to my channel. Today we will do a computer worksheet on MS Windows for class 3. So let's start. Choose the correct option. This software gets automatically loaded into the computer's memory when the computer is switched on. The options are A desktop, B taskbar, C operating system, D none of these. And the answer is C operating system. It uses pictures to represent the input and output of a program. Options are A GUI, B taskbar, C desktop or D none of these and the answer is A GUI that is graphical user interface. The taskbar contains A quick launch bar, B start button, C system tray or D all of these and the answer is D all of these. Into how many panes is the start menu divided? Options are A1, B2, C3 or D4? And the answer is B2. The shutdown button is present in the options are A start menu, B quick launch bar, C system tray, or D none of these and the answer is A start menu. To select non adjacent icons on the desktop select A alt B shift C control or D none of these and the answer is C control. Fill in the blanks. Number 1. A computer program that allows us to operate a computer is operating system. The all programs option is used to display the complete list of programs present in the computer. Number 3. When you switch on the computer, the Windows operating system gets loaded into the computer memory automatically. This process is called booting. Number 4. The icons that provide status and notifications are present in the notification area of the desktop which is called the personalization. True or false? Number 1. Icons are the small pictures seen on the desktop. This statement is true. Number two, a computer can easily function without an operating system. This statement is false because we know that a computer cannot function without an operating system. Number three, an active window can be minimized by clicking its taskbar button. No, this statement is false. Number four, to switch off a computer, just switch off the power supply. This statement is false because we need to shut down a computer properly. Answer the following questions. Question number one. What is an operating system? And the answer is an operating system is a computer program that allows us to operate a computer. A computer cannot function without an operating system. Question number two. How will you select a group of adjacent icons on the desktop? We know that to select adjacent icons on the desktop, we have to press the shift key and then click the icons you wish to select. Question number three. 
what is task bar answer is the task bar is the long horizontal bar at the bottom of the screen it contains buttons with icons which tell us which programs are open on the computer question number 4 what is the use of search box on the start menu and the answer is the search box at the bottom of the left pane allows you to search for programs and files on your computer question number 5 What is the difference between normal mode and safe mode? And the answer is in normal mode Windows loads with all files and drivers that is required for proper functioning of computer whereas in safe mode Windows loads with limited set of files and drivers. If your computer starts in safe mode it means there is a problem with the computer. Question number 6 What are icons give two examples and the answer is the desktop contains small pictures they are called icons and the examples are my computer and recycle bin Question number 7 What is the function of start button and the answer is The start button can be used to find and open any program file or folders on a computer. Question number 8. Write the names of three power modes of the computer. Answer is the three power modes of computer are shutdown, sleep mode and hibernate mode. that is the end of the video please like the video and subscribe to my channel and click the bell icon to get new video updates bye bye